Evening all, welcome to some, well, Ambush. What the flipping heck is going on with playing Ambush? Um, right, well, hello. I'm really, really hungover right now. Like, I don't know if you ever have those moments. Do you get hangovers? Do you remember your first hangover? I remember my first hangover. <clears throat> it was it was messy. That's all I remember. It was messy. I woke up just literally as if I had been, like, spewing all night, just fountaining it into the air on top of me as lying on my back. Because I woke up with bits of carrot all over my face, and it was just gross, seriously. Nice image for you to be regaled with in the morning. Um, it's, yeah, so had about three hours sleep. We did the militia event last night. If you haven't checked it, um, check the live stream we did. We did an all militia event. Um, and oh my god, it's painful. Militia is just ridiculously bad. So if you imagine like you're a new player and your name is Newbie McNuberson and you come into this game and you are just then thrown into a match with um, people maybe not as high tier as this, but certainly there or thereabouts. You're going to have a very bad time, as Schley would say. Um, and quite frankly, it's just abysmally bad how, <laughs> how people would just... I was just getting stomped. And it wasn't that, you know, you could kind of say, well, you know, if you're good enough shot, you might survive. No, 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 no. You just get ridiculously killed by heavy machine guns, which seem to be fit at the month now. Um, oh, to be honest, it was, a, it was like watching a bullfight, but not in a, not in a nice way, a bad way. And it was just, oh, terrible. So there we go. So that's my kind of hangover from that. So I drank heavily. I got really ragey. So, you know, when you watch these videos, you see a very refined English gentleman speaking with eloquence. And you see a very, I guess, witty repartee of uh, comments, words, and discussion around Dust514. The reality is I am about as subtle as a... As I guess urine, <laughs> I'm about as subtle as urinating on the floor of a convent. I'm about as subtle as being mugged in a train station toilet. And I think, to be honest, the <laughs> the vast majority of um, of these videos obviously is done with me in a good mood. But there are times, particularly when I'm drinking, when I just get ragey beyond belief. So if you've never heard me rage, and let's face it, you must have, because I've done plenty of rage videos. Uh, but if you haven't heard me rage, go and check out the live stream. It's long. It's like four hours something. But tell you what, you'll see an absolute just you know abattoir of a match over and over and over again as I run militia and I'm getting shot by dudes with aim-assisted single-shot scrambler rifles and etc. etc. So you know, don't hate Proto because you kind of need it to be competitive. So let's just not forget that. Anyways, here we go. So this was an ambush we did. Um, couldn't tell you why. It looks like an OMS as well, which is pretty disappointing. But uh, we decided to give it a go um, just because... Oh, I don't know, actually. I can't remember. This isn't even the the weapons event, which we'll get to in a minute. Um, this is just literally running a, uh, a pretty good gang of uh, dudes running around, sticking together. And our whole mission objective was, dude, don't run away. And that's when our, when our entire mission objective is stay together. That's pretty bad. Um, running logic. Now watch this. You're about to see my whole team die, but I survive, so I'm a really bad logic, and that's that's a really great accolade to have, I guess. Um, I do like lodging, actually. I mean, I know people. Are, I mean, somebody dead, dead right in my comments that um, look at that almost died. They dead right in the comments that they're getting a bit bored of plasma cannon and uh, flaylock footage, sir. When I find you, you're in trouble. I'm kidding, of course. I do obviously want to run other things. Um, I mean, yesterday I was running very many different things. But look at that. My whole team's dead. All dead. All gone. And I'm having to get them up and uh, watch them be killed again. But look, this suit doesn't die. This is the luckiest suit in the world. It is made entirely of rabbit's feet. That is why it is so, so good. <laughs> look at that. My whole team's dead around me. <laughs> and it's only me. Help. <laughs> Oh, this is good. This is, look at that, almost dead, almost dead. Let's get a dude up, so here we go. I'm being a bit of a troll medic, I know, but I, you know, I, the worst thing I hate is raising somebody from the dead. And then, uh, you know, they get shot immediately. I hate that, I don't like that, so uh, yeah. But that's it, so to be honest, that was an, a miraculous survive right there. See, I didn't die, I didn't die, that was pretty funny. Let's get this dude up. So yeah, I think, uh, you know, back to the event, you know, it was a pretty pretty terrible affair and I did it really to highlight to CCP that they probably 
need to look again at the well to be honest is there any point are they are there new players coming to this game highly unlikely are there new people um playing this game with a view to you know oh do you know what? they're not they're not simple as that they're not playing this game that you know we don't have a new player experience so you know why bother with it um i don't know really what people are thinking in that kind of if, you know endeavor because it just feels like at the moment that all they're really looking at is the is the you know surviving player base and their continuation and their can you know their their kind of uh you know their existence they're not really thinking of new player experience it shows me pretty categorically that ccp rarely play their own game at that level maybe they have characters that can run advanced and that's generally what i've always seen so when we ran with saber wing we usually see him with you know advanced gear which is kind of fair enough whereas i just honestly don't think that they get into a group like they do in eve they apparently get in frigates and they go for a roam and they obviously die and that's really what they should have done in this is there should have been a gang of developers you know rolling around in all militia gear and we can just stomp the shit out of them so they can then see how bad militia is therefore really that is a, a great indicator of how new players coming into this game then get put up against people in prototype who are good at the game and then they get their little little sweet little faces stomped and smooshed all the way in and by not looking after those dudes that is really why the game didn't grow because you know i, I know people who joined the game played it you know they saw the videos they liked the game or the look of it they, they create a little character, they log in, they get stomped six times in a row, they, they uninstall and go play something else. And that is exactly what happened. Now, think about it. All of the PS3s around the world are now kind of finding their way um, to... How do I put this in polite way? People buy PS4s, they trade in their PS3, the PS3 then finds its way to, I guess, lower economically advantaged countries, like mobile phones. That's exactly the model of the mobile phones. That's why you can sell your mobile phone or your cell phone. You just sell it to a company, they refurbish it, then they sell it almost as pretty much brand new to uh, a developing nation, or more or less. Not entirely, but you know, it could be. Um, and that's what's happening kind of with the PS3. So CCP should really be looking to cash in on that. So, you know, for example, are they looking to maybe, you know, pitch this game further or are they just going to let it die? To me, it's it's the startling lack of direction with this game. And the, you know, it, it, there's nothing a player can do here. Let's be clear on this. It needs, and there's nothing my, half of CCP can do. It needs somebody to say at the highest level, this is what our plan is for Dust. It may change. But this is our plan. At the moment, all they've said is, Legion's coming. And then everything else has been a, dis a discussion of, a sub you know, kind of conjecture from that point. So to be honest, we don't know. Dust may continue forever. We know it's not, let's face it. But the reality is, is that they haven't decided what to do with this game. And to be honest, they're not really helping their cause by being the way they're being, if that makes sense. They're not really kind of pushing the, the envelope at all. Anyway, so there we go. Amazing match. Uh, just an absolute stomp. And I hope you enjoyed it. And we'll see you next time.